Welcome to Warriors TV. Tonight we are talking with Warriors forward Callum Queen. And first of all, Callum, thank you for joining us and, uh, well, welcome back. Thank you for having me, Adam. So uh, you're back for another season. Um, what are you looking forward to this year? I think the way we left it off last season, just finishing second in the league and then not not quite grabbing the playoffs. But hopefully this season we can, uh, can win the league and the playoffs. Yeah, so we were very strong last year. So do you think we can close the gap on them this year? Yeah, I don't really, other than that one game that we got destroyed, I think uh, every other game was really close. So I don't see why uh, it was either anyone could have grabbed it. So it was just unlucky, unlucky for us and unlucky for Solway, to be fair. Yeah, just uh, just fine margins, really, weren't they? Yeah, not not nothing, nothing really far away. Like, so um, everyone presumes it'll be the Warriors and the Sharks up at the top, but um, the chasing pack has really sort of closed up a lot, hasn't it? Likes of Widness and Deeside coming into the league as well. Yeah, it'll be uh, interesting to see who Deeside signed. Uh, but other than that, I, I haven't really seen anything else from Deeside, but. So it's never a nice ice rink to go to and play. So yeah, well, this was a long, long journey as well, isn't it? Yeah, it's a horrible journey. Same as Nottingham and Blackburn. Uh, fixtures due out this evening. Um, although this interview is going to go out sometime after that, but um, I, I guess the excitement starting to build now. We know who uh, who the Warriors have got on the first weekend. Actually, haven't seen haven't seen them yet, so I don't actually okay. know when when we're playing. So not, Nottingham <laughs> at home is the uh, the first game on the fourth uh, of September. Oh well, so yeah, that's all right then. I don't mind playing Nottingham, <laughs> especially for the first game. Yeah, it should be a good one. And also on the uh, the fixtures this year is a, a trip again up well up to Edinburgh, and we'll be hosting them as well in a, a sort of glamour friendly uh, series. So. That's always good to play those games with the likes of Edinburgh or Murrayfield, as they were previously, because uh, there always tend to be uh, quite a good rivalry there. Yeah, I think all the Scottish teams, I mean, we always struggle against them for some reason, the likes of Solway and Murrayfield and even Dundee. So it'll be interesting to see what goes on then. It certainly will. Now, Callum, this is your third season back since... Uh, returning from uh, from Canada. So what's it been like for you since you've come back to Tyneside? Uh, to be fair, I haven't really adjusted as much as I would want to. I feel like I, I definitely could put up more points and goals and assists, to be fair. But, I mean, it's, it's just the way it goes. Sometimes you have a good, good game, you have bad games, good season, bad season. So hopefully this season upcoming, I put some more uh, more pucks in the nets and get more, get more points. Yeah, and obviously a slightly different role for you since you've returned home because before you went to Canada, you were very much a, a flying winger, whereas now you you got a bit more responsibility playing centre and taking face-offs. Yeah, I kind of just got through into that, the, the centre role, but I mean, I don't, I don't mind it. It's a little bit more skating than normally you do on the wing, but it's, it's all right. Yeah. Um, and last season, how how did you think that went for you personally? Like I, like I just said, I think uh, I think myself, I was a bit disappointed in myself because I mean, average in the game, it's not. I'm, I'm better than that, but we'll we'll see we'll see this season. Yeah, and uh, obviously we're last in action back in April at Leeds for a playoff, so it's it's been a few weeks since we've last seen you, so. What have you been doing with yourself this summer? Well, to be fair, I've just been uh, I'm working at my dad's pub up in uh, Amble now, so I'm just uh, just working away. Really, I'm six days a week just working, trying to get some money. Well, there's worse ways to be uh, spending your time. I'm sure you've got to pay the bills. <laughs> yeah, sadly. <laughs> well, great to uh, have you back, Callum, and uh, thank you very much for your time and talking to us. Thank you, Adam. Uh, looking forward to seeing you soon.